And here is my final solution. And this is already mounted, and you can see from the profile how much is space between both um, the flash bulb and the modeling light from the gel. So basically, I'm having a very ample room, and I can take this cylinder, move it to any kind of other softbox that I have that uses the same speed ring which most of them have the same exact size of the speed ring so here we go this is the profile picture of it no uh, kind of leak of any kind of light everything is going to be warmed up to the uh, gel that I'm using here it's 1 over 8 gel and those tabs that I folded Kind of help keeping this in place you can put a small teeny scotch tape if you want to support it that's fine as i mentioned i put some of the uh, baby a clamp to keep this attached to the speed ring and those kind of relief cuts that i made allowed it to go inside this rod and stretch a little bit beyond so basically that goes all the way here if I didn't make those relief cuts, this is going to be sitting flush with this rod and it's not going to work. So those relief cuts, I marked them to the speed ring and they go uh, with the octobox, like I made eight. With the soft box, you're going to use four of those relief cuts. You're still going to be good. With the strip box, it's a little bit different because you have to make extra two cuts for the strip box, which is going to utilize only this and this on the other side is going to be both two here so here this is the flap that I made all right and that covers completely and goes on the top of it and again as I mentioned to you you can support it if you want with the scotch tape you should be okay small teeny scotch tape is not going to affect the light temperature but basically it's gonna sit still I mean I'm using one hand here I'm sorry so it's not like a completely industrial solution but hey I'm gonna try to turn on the modeling lamp I'm gonna put it on the lowest power so here's the modeling lamp Yes, it's generating some heat, but look how far it is. Even with a modeling lamp on a small power, I should be good. I'm warming up my uh, softbox light to the uh, strength I need. And this is a good solution. I think. I mean, I didn't lose much as far as the uh, CTO gel. Uh, I'm going to turn off the modeling lamp. Still, heat is acceptable. I'm further away from it. Significant safety distance, even from the modeling lamp, all right? Okay, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna turn it off. And this is what's left from the 20, from the 20 by 24, sheet I can use those for speed lights I have different use for them they're not going to be wasted and this is only what I wasted here so basically very small teeny amount those are the relief cuts that I made that's all I wasted all right uh, here's my solution I'm not claiming it's the best solution I've never seen anyone put it on uh, YouTube before so I'm trying uh, to share with you guys what I am doing for myself um, have a good day. Bye.